My next guest says it all started as a simple birthday wish for her friends to donate to a cause. But when she learned one in three families cannot afford diapers for their children, it quickly became her life's mission. My name is Megan Sollenberger. I'm from Madison, Wisconsin, and I am the founder and CEO of a diaper bank. The diaper bank all started back in 2017. Hurricane Harvey had just hit the Houston area and I discovered diaper need was an issue that wasn't being addressed by any public assistance programs. So I decided to host a fundraiser to try to help the victims. I went from a $500 goal to raising over $3,000 in a two week period. Cheers. Cheers. Initially, it was a little bit scary going from two incomes to one in the middle of a pandemic, but I've also found that it's given me so much more balance with my own family. I'm able to make my own schedule, which are all just perks that come along with mission or effort to help others. Oh, Megan and her husband, Blake, join us from Madison, Wisconsin. Welcome. Hi. Oh my gosh, well, congratulations on this, Megan. I, this story is so fascinating. This started with the birthday fundraiser, and then you pivoted to something of a full-time schedule with this. Was it a conscious decision, or did you just start, before you know it, it's eight hours, 16, and you're thinking about it, and you can't walk away from it? How did it turn full-time? You know, it was a bit of a slippery slope, um, but really the pandemic was the catalyst that really made me assess my full-time responsibilities and where those best fit. So I was working full-time um, on an HR team at a big local company, um, feeling fulfilled and successful in that role as well. But the diaper bank just became too much of a pull once we got so busy with the pandemic. Wow. Um, and I really felt my heart calling me to take that on full-time um, and leave my other responsibilities behind. Like, what was it like watching her find this purpose? Because so often, when you love people, part of that love is when you see them happy. To see her happy in that form and purposeful, what did that mean? Yeah, no, uh, I get that question a lot as a supporting spouse. And, um, you know, one of the things I always like to say is, you know, spouses are supposed to be supportive of each other. She's moved across the country for me for my job. When I had the chance to support her in this thing that was putting this big shine in her eyes to help others, um, you know, it was kind of like falling in love with her all over again. Oh. Uh, you, you really see her grow with this passion and this mission. And, you know, it's not a question of how do we do it? It's, you know, how could we not? Oh, I mean, and that's the thing. How could we not? Megan, you, you bring awareness to something that I think can easily be taken for granted, diapers, right? And whether it's a natural disaster or financial disaster of any kind, this is something far too many people have to struggle to think how they're going to get these things. This very basic essential in raising a baby. Yeah, you know, a lot of people also just don't even know the problem exists. Yeah. I mean, I myself never struggled with the issue when my kids were that small. And so it's easy to overlook things that don't affect us. Yeah. Well, we are so moved by all the work you're doing for families and the assistance that you've given. I and the team here would like to provide 4,000 diapers to families in your area. Thank you so much. That's over $1,000 in diapers. So here's the deal. As a mom, I recognize 4,000 diapers really mean one night. But, <laughs> but you are a superhero and it's honor to be a sidekick. So from our TAM fam to you and yours, Please know that we are here, and we hope that these 4,000 diapers go to your point to provide dignity to the families who we should be helping. So congratulations. Thank you so much. Yes. <laughs> and Blake, congratulations on the baby on the way, the beautiful family. You all are just so inspiring. The teamwork that made this dream work is so great to see. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for having us.